Well, if you have an Apple device with FaceTime on it, you might need to disable it after the discovery of a new bug in the app. And it's probably going to creep you out when you hear this story. CBS 14's Lori Wallace is live in Lodi. Lori, when I first heard this, I immediately went and disabled my FaceTime. Tell us more. <laughs> Hey there, Dina. Good morning. Yeah, I've already been worrying about Alexa and what that hears in my house. Now you got to worry about FaceTime. If you have an Apple device, an iPhone, an iPad, you're going to want to disable that FaceTime app now. And that's just for a temporary, uh, a temporary time. And because Apple is hoping to have this all fixed here very soon. So you mentioned it. The problem is people are able to listen to these calls uh, before the person actually picks up on the other end. And that's not even the worst of it, Dina. Listen to this. The user can even see. Through through the front facing camera of the person they're calling. Now, Apple did say they do have a fix for the problem. They're planning on releasing it in a software update later this week. Until then, though, Apple says the safest bet, do what you did. Just disable FaceTime on your Apple device until the update is available. I did the same thing this morning, Dina. It's a two-step, very easy thing to do, as you probably know. You just click on your settings, find FaceTime there, click on it. Where you see it green, you're just going to want to tap that and disable it just like that. Very simple and it's going to save you from someone maybe hearing or seeing something that you didn't want them to hear or see. Back over to you. Absolutely. I know you were just showing the phone and the process, but we were still showing video during that time, Lori. So one more time, can you pull the phone up? I know you oh, said it's yes. just one little okay. click, one little push of a button. Yeah, it's just one little click, just your settings. You just go straight to your settings. I already mm -hmm. did mine there, but you were going to want to find your FaceTime, which right there in green. Yep. And then when you click on it, it's likely going to be green if you have it uh, on your phone. You're just going to want to click it and get rid of that green uh, temporarily until you hear that Apple has fixed the bug. And then you can go ahead and turn it back on. Turn but it I'd back wait. On. I'd wait for that bug to be fixed. Exactly. Yeah, I think I will just rely on the good old telephone conversation <laughs> for a little while. <laughs> all right, Lori Wallace reporting live for us this morning. Thank you for the great tutorial as well this morning. Keep us all safe. <laughs>